everybody hear me okay? Yes, we're good. All right, thumbs up. So yeah, as Kath said, um, you know, my name is Dr. Ben Stuckel. I'm going to start with just an introduction here, you guys. And then I am going to shift over to a screen share so you guys can kind of see the PowerPoint I'm going to do. Um, so hopefully all this transitions well and we just flow through this thing seamlessly. But as Kath said, my name is Dr. Ben Stuckel. I am a chiropractor from Gregory, South Dakota. Um, I have been uh, in practice for 15 years, a lot of interest in nutrition, um, uh, have a certification in sports nutrition, and just joined Yoli about six, seven years ago now. Um, and like she said, we are double diamonds in that company. Um, I've now spoke for this company all over the country. I am part of the Yoli Doctors Advisory Board for the nutrition, one of five. Four other very capable people have joined us on that. And uh, we are involved in kind of the production of the products um, and also just advising Yoli Corporate as to what we need to do and why we need to maintain our integrity when it comes to these products. So it's a, it's a great position and I think it speaks volumes for our company that they involve us and allow us to be part of that and to make sure that Yoli continues to go the right direction. So without further ado, I am gonna share my screen here. We're gonna talk a little bit about the value of Yoli products, okay? All right, hopefully we can all see my screen. Value of Yoli products, you guys. So we're gonna talk about the value. We're also gonna talk a, a little bit about the impact Yoli might have on your life and what it does for you. So we need to talk first about value versus worth because we get this question a lot, right? I mean, it costs money to stay healthy, you guys. And what we, gotta, what we wanna be careful of is, is putting a value that's fictitious on those products and just looking at that on its face value, right? So. We got to make sure that you understand what the worth is um, versus just how much the cost, just the price. So we need to talk about the customer experience, the product quality. Those two things are huge, you guys, when it comes to an individual product or to a line of products or a system like Yoli. So we divide that by the price and end up with the value. Basically, the bottom, it says, your value doesn't decrease based on someone's inability to see your worth. I would say Yoli is no different. Yoli's value doesn't decrease based on somebody's inability to see your worth. We have to get that across to people. And we hear that in the testimonies. We hear people talk about on the front end, it's all about the weight loss. And if they don't lose a few pounds right away, they're discouraged and having problem. They don't see the value. So all of a sudden the price becomes a factor. But when we go into this thing and really look at it more on a line of, look, it's about the long haul, as Mark said in his testimony. Um, it's, it's about more of the lifestyle change. Then all of a sudden we can assign a true value. And what is that worth? What is your health truly worth? So is maintaining health, is gaining health really truly worth it? Well, let's look at a few statistics. The average cost of common diseases. And there are some references off to the right on that screen. Cancer, $270,000 for one year of life. And that's an average, once you've been diagnosed with an aggressive form of cancer, money is gonna flow out the window like crazy, you guys. A heart attack, $760,000 average lifetime cost. Type two diabetes, something we are very familiar with in this line of work because we run into a lot of people that have these health challenges, $10,970 a year, according to the Diabetes Care Re Report put out in 2014. So we're spending money hand over fist. Just being obese, quote unquote, $2,741 a year more than somebody who is not. So when it comes to worth, we have to look at both sides, right? It seems that when we, we present and we talk about gaining health or a product or a system like we have in Yoli, people want to really pick it apart and look it over and really break it down. And yet right in front of them, staring them in the face are maybe one, two, three, or all of these different things. And yet we're not talking about them. 
We're not talking about them being obese and what it's costing them. We're not talking about their diabetes and what it's costing. Them. We're not talking about, you know, the everyday cup of Starbucks, the soda, whatever it is, and that cost that's presenting to them. It's expensive to be healthy, but believe it or not, you guys, it's expensive to be sick. So what's the cost for Yoli? When we compare that to the cost of a transformation kit, which is truly, truly life-changing, 285 bucks, you guys, come on. You know, you could be on $285 kit for the rest of your life and not touch some of these numbers. Now, am I on here suggesting that Yoli's gonna prevent cancer, prevent heart attack, any of that? Absolutely not. You know, we don't want to uh, lead people on to that idea. But at the same note, am I suggesting that gaining your health decreases the odds of some of these things? Of course it does. So we want to make sure we're looking at that. How big is this problem? So you can see the chart there, hopefully. Uh, we've got nutritional factor diseases and mortality. So death rates of the approximate 2.4 million deaths that occur in the U.S. each year, nearly 75% are the result of an avoidable, and I say that again, avoidable nutritional factor disease, right? So look at that list. You've got heart disease, cancer, stroke, respiratory problems, diabetes, Alzheimer's, and I guarantee you that one's moving up the list along with dementia, kidney disease, liver disease, and other nutritionals. So you guys, those are the big killers in our country. And we, we have the ability to prevent them. We have the ability, whether you're talking genetics or not, we could go into epigenetics and say, look, you have the ability, you may be born with those genes for heart disease, but that doesn't necessarily mean you have to turn on the switch. Therein lies epigenetics. We have the ability to choose whether we strive to turn that switch on or turn it off. And, and those are environmental factors. Those are things under our control for the most part. And so we wanna make sure we're doing everything in our power to turn those off. So when it comes to the big killers in our country, you guys, they're nutritional factor. They're the very thing that we are attempting to make a change for the better. So what's the answer? The doctor of the future will give no medicine, but will interest his patients in the care of the human frame in diet and in the cause and prevention of disease. That was Thomas Edison, that was a long time ago, you guys. You know, this is not new. This idea, this concept, this is nothing new. This has been thought of by many, many powerful brains many, many years ago. It's just that now I think there's a movement that we're seeing um, in people starting to wanna take care of themselves and understanding that what we do for the majority of our life is what affects us at the end. And, and as Dr. Aaron has said in his videos, you know, it's, it's the cruise ship or the nursing home and which one do you wanna be on? So does prevention, quote unquote, really work? And I put that in quotes on purpose. And, and there's a reason. I want you to look at that chart. <clears throat> so we have things like preventative health guidelines. We have blood pressure, cholesterol tests, pap smears, mammograms, breast exams, testicular exams, all of these are our, our tests, right? And they're quote unquote prevention. A 2000 study in the Journal of Health Affairs calculated that if 90% of the US population used proven preventative services, like the ones listed on the chart, it would save only 2% of healthcare expenditures. So if that's the case, what are we talking about? Why are we even talking about prevention? Well, I'll tell you why, because we need to understand the difference between prevention and early detection. The tests on this chart, you guys, are all about early detection, but they're labeled prevention. So the, the, the healthcare model that has been developed in the United States is all about early detection. And again, I, I wanna make something very clear here. I'm not suggesting don't go get tested for early detective tests. I mean, that's not what I'm trying to promote. What I'm trying to promote is that you guys understand the difference, that we're not talking about a blood pressure test. We're not talking about, you know, going to get a mammogram or a colonoscopy. Those don't really, in theory, prevent anything. They just tell you whether you have something already actively happened. And the idea of Yoli and the idea of what we're trying to do here, you guys, is on the front of that. We're trying to be out front, more proactive, trying to address those issues before they become the problem. 
so that when you're getting your early detective tests, they're clear. And that's the idea. So we need to make sure we differentiate that. So let's talk about what is true prevention, right? It's all about eating right. It's about detoxing, hydrating, moving right, supporting a healthy gut, sleeping right, about restore and rebuild the human cells, and then fighting, fighting against those pathogens. So that is true prevention. So how do we do that? We need to talk about does pre true prevention, like I just got done talking about, actual preventive measures, do they actually have value? Do they provide a value in the marketplace? Well, according to IBM Corporation, they estimate that they have saved nearly $175 million, along with the resulting 6 to 15% reduction in insurance premiums by utilizing health and wellness programs for their employees. I'll guarantee you those weren't mammograms and colonoscopies, okay? Those were true wellness programs, nutritional things, uh, diet, exercise, you know, those core values that we have to actually gaining health. So does it provide a value? Absolutely. I mean, they can put a dollar sign on $175 million. And if you look at the 6 to 15% reduction in insurance on a corporation, the size of IBM, I would stand to guess that's millions of dollars in savings. So implementing these strategies, you guys, is key and it's huge. So how do we get people to see the value of Yoli, right? Because there's a lot of great products out there. There's a lot of products that exist that at least make an attempt to do what we do here at Yoli. I would say it's this, people don't buy our products. They buy our relationships, testimony, and the magic of a BLP. To, to be belong to something, to be loved, and to have a purpose. That's BLP. And that's something at Yoli we do amazingly well. And I say magic because it truly is. It isn't always all about the products. People make assumptions with companies like this that our products are going to be good. They're going to be top of the line but that doesn't automatically make them jump on board with us. Truthfully, it's what you guys do. It's, it's the follow-up you do. It's the love you provide to them and the help and the troubleshooting. It's the testimonies we have, as you've already heard, um, some amazing stuff, you guys. The testimonies are just unbelievable when it comes not only to weight loss, but other health challenges we all face that are those nutritional factor diseases. And finally, we're a face-to-face -face business. And that's the best part, right? So yeah, we couldn't do an event li uh, live and in person. We can do this over, over a medium like, like Zoom and Facebook Live. And that's amazing. And so we like to get knee to knee and belly to belly with people. And, and people can respond to that. And I encourage that. So the true impact. I talked about the value. The true impact of Yoli is this. And I quote, I want to die young, but as late in life as possible. And that should really, really sink home to you guys. The idea is not to live forever. The idea is to live as well as you can for as long as you can. You know, we, we want to be able to still function. We want to be on that cruise ship, you guys. And Yoli is just a tool. And what we offer is that tool. And it's a, a one piece to the puzzle. Um, to providing you a life that as you age, you age, age gracefully. And that, I think, when it really comes down to it, that's what everybody is, is concerned about, is what's going to happen to me later? You know, I hear people in my clinic, in my office all the time, talking about, well, I don't want to live that long. And the truth is, do they not want to live that long, or do they just don't want to deal with um, the decay, basically, that happens as we age? And that's, that's the reality. So... We all want to die young, but as late in the life as possible. So now we know why, right? We know why we should be doing something like Yoli, why we should be addressing our health concerns, why we should be um, going through this program, why it's worth it, why the value is totally there. In fact, it's the best value on the market. You know, if we, if we compare it to the cost of getting sick, we know the value is there. Now let's talk a little bit about how. So we're gonna talk about the transformation kit, right? This is the staple of Yoli's products. And, and it is a box kit that everything is involved 
and it just takes care of you and leads you down a path to better health, less inflammation, better detox, et cetera, et cetera. But it is our core, the transformation kit. In the transformation kit, we have a few key products. Number one, Alkali. Number two, we have Yes Shakes, which is a whey protein shake. We have Passion, which is our energy drink. We have Pure, an unbelievable probiotic and gut health supplement. And then we have Resolve, which is our fiber and helps us to digest our meals better. Let's go into Alkali, the first and probably the star, if you will, of the transformation kit. It's a patented product. Um, and I, I say a tool, you guys, to help the body alkalize. And I say that because that's what it is. It is something that provides the body the key nutrients to rebuild a portion of the human body so that we have the ability to alkalize on our own. I want to make that very clear. It is a tool to help us alkalize. So what is, what is alkalization all about? Why is that so important? And why is alkali the key supplement? It's a key supplement because alkalization is a huge problem. We are very acidic in the United States, whether and mostly it's because of the, the SAD, the standard American diet. So alkalization reduces inflammation, increases our oxygen content at a cellular level, reduces acidic waste and helps improve insulin binding. So we talk about metabolic acidosis, which is just a deep term for unhealthy cells, right? They are, we, ultimately ends up in like type 2 diabetes. As acidic is synonymous with oxygen starved. So without oxygen. Well, you all know without oxygen, we die. Well, our cells are very similar. I mean, at a, at, a, at a true rate, we are what we eat. We are what our cells are. And if we starve our cells of oxygen, we're going to die. Decreased oxygen forces the cells to use fermentation for energy, which results in cellular damage. So if we're not providing good oxygen content to our cells, we're basically withering away, we're eating away at ourselves. Uh, another key note, insulin binding. So when your blood sugar goes up, insulin is the hormone that helps regulate. Insulin binding decreases 50%, so half, after exposure to just 6.9 pH. And that's for just 48 hours, you guys. And 6.9 is, I'm, I'm going to say it's quite acidic, but in the grand scheme of things, that's not even that terrible. You know, we're looking at a 7.365, you know, 7 is usually considered neutral. So just 6.9, it can decrease our insulin binding, binding at those sites, helping us remove blood sugar. Well, why is that important? Because excess sugar roaming around the human body causes more inflammation. So that's alkali, you guys. An amazing product, probably the one that sets us apart from all other systems on the market. Let's talk about the passion. Passion is our energy drink. It's full of B vitamins. B vitamins unlock the energy in our foods. They can help us to convert carbs to glucose. They promote cell growth and reproduction. And they're needed for form formation of serotonin, dopamine, epinephrine. These are neurochemicals that make us feel happy. Why do you think when we drink happy, we have a, or when we drink happy, when we drink passion, we're happy. It's because of those neurochemicals. And then uh, Thermo G. Thermo G is what, you know, a lot of other products have B vitamins, but not everybody has the Thermo G blend. That's Cystis and Ervingia, which help with weight loss, improve our lipid profiles, and work best when they're taken together. This is all research back, you guys. Choline bra improves brain function by increasing acetylcholine. That's why passion, when we drink passion, not only do we feel energy, we feel focus. That's due to maybe the choline. The GABA, um, which quiets nerve activity, makes us feel calm, so we're not jittery. The superfruits, full of them. Cardiovascular research, decreased plaque and platelet aggregation. And then natural caffeine, not some artificial stuff just giving us this huge peak. It's a slow and steady lift with all the vitamins and nutrients left intact. That's what makes it natural, right? We haven't stripped it down to, to, to provide only that artificial energy. And then it's sweetened with xylitol, erythritol, and stevia. So naturally sweetened. We'll move on to thermal burn. Now thermal burn um, is basically our pill form or our capsule form of the passion, right? So for those of you who are not into taking another drink or for convenience factor or travel or what have you, you don't want to do the passion or you want to do a little bit of both, mix and match, thermal burn is for you. What, 
what is thermal burn? Thermal burn is basically a capsule form of passion plus three key ingredients, L-carnitine, which helps the body burn fat for fuel, fucoxanthin, which is a seaweed derivative that promotes fat loss, and raspberry ketones, which studies back it for increased weight loss. So for those of you that need that convenience, want to get away from the drinks, you know, thermal burns for you. For those of you who might have hit plateaus, where you, you're still doing the transformation kit, but you seem to be on this plateau, consider switching over to thermal burn for a month. And that might give you what you need to just boost off that plateau. We're moving into the yes shakes, the Yoli essential shake. Yes, um, it's a whey protein concentrate shake, which is key. In, you know, versus a, an isolate is less broke down, you guys. Isolates may have a higher protein content, but at the expense of removing a lot of the good stuff that truly makes it healthy. We're not at Yoli all about only getting the protein in and the max amount uh, of grams. We're about health. We're about cellular health. And in order to achieve that, we have to be a whey protein concentrate. So we see there's a 3D structure still intact, so it's closer to what, what it originally was in nature. We use cold processing, which allows the bacteria, which is key, to remain active. Um, it's considered a whole food, which means the body can absorb it more efficiently. It's more bioavailable to the cells. And it's one of the best precursors to glutathione. Glutathione, you guys, is like air. Glutathione is one of the most important substances to the human body, period. It is without it, we die, period. And you, right now, the research is not really backing very well being able to take glutathione independent. We have to take precursors to glutathione so that we make our own. And so turns out whey protein concentrate is one of the best when it's processed correctly. So we're not all created equal when they don't use cold processing, when they strip it of some of the things, um, you know, they remove some of the fats and, and vitamins, they remove the ability to be a precursor to glutathione. So you'll see that in there, I said the double bond cysteine is very sensitive structure, broken easily by high temps, agitation, and oxidation. Why did I put that in there? Because we need to understand that it's not ideal to take a good quality whole shake like we have, throw it in a high speed blender and let it blend for 30 seconds straight. You know, that agitation, that heat creation can actually break up that cysteine bond that, that helps um, make glutathione. So just make sure you're using your shaker cups. You can use a blender, but you need to pulse. Um, there's no direct line as to where that exists, as to how much you can and can't do or how much you can blend. All that I do is encourage you to use your shaker. And I'll tell you, you guys, I've personally used a ton of shakes. I know you maybe have as well. They clump, they're terrible, they taste bad. There's all these problems. Yoli's shake beats them out of the water. I mean, it isn't even close. Our shake mixes up so great, even by just shaking it or stirring with a fork, no big deal. So what sets our shake, the, the Yoli Essential Shake, apart from any other Yoli, uh, whey protein concentrate? Well, it's the Lean Immune Blend. The Lean Immune Blend is a, is a key factor here, you guys. It's got pomegranate, which is an amazing antioxidant. Keratin provides some more B vitamins. Olive leaf inhibits viruses and bacteria, so it's helping with gut health. Grapeseed increases our HDL, our good cholesterol, and decreases our bad. Cysis, which is, uh, uh, promotes bone growth and weight loss. Alfalfa, yeah, we have alfalfa in our shake. It's biotin and helps flush the bowels of toxin. Maki, which helps with blood, per blood sugar and pressure management. It's a great anti-inflammatory. We even get some broccoli in there, high in vitamins but also helps to decrease allergens effect on the body. And then finally, bacillus coagulans, which is our probiotic. So we even put probiotics in our shakes to help our body absorb these better. So amazing, amazing shake, you guys. One of the best on the market, I guarantee. Now let's move on to our probiotic, the Pure. Uh, the key ingredient of Pure is a probiotic strain, which I just told you about, called Bacillus Coagulans, or Ganadin BC30 is the company right now we're using to formulate. Um, but Bacillus Coagulans, it's a spore form, which means that the bacteria are still in a state where they have a protective spore around them. And there are only a few of those in nature. And so 
Um, they're, they're really, really important because that spore is what protects those bacteria from the gut, the, the stomach acid. A lot of these uh, um, probiotics will promote huge numbers, billions, billions and billions of bacteria to try. And the reason they're doing that is they're trying to get it through the hostile environment of the stomach. And a lot of those bacteria die as they make their way to that small intestine. The spore form probiotics are the exception. They hold that spore, the spore protects them as they travel through the gut, and they ultimately reach the small intestine without damage. They can help decrease inflammation in the gut. They aid in digestion of proteins, lactose and fructose, and is taken with prebiotics. It will increase the health and number of other good bacteria. That's a key one, you guys, because we hear all the time, well, this probiotic has a lot more than yours. This one has different strains than yours. Well, the truth is that little bit of research, and that was off of a white paper research, that when we take Ganadin BC30, Bacillus coagulans, with prebiotics, which we have in our, in our Alkasher blend in the pure, it will increase the health and the number of other good bacteria in the gut. So it's not just about the number. I want you guys to understand that. It's about the health of the ecosystem. And Pure does an amazing job with Alkasher of creating health within the microbiome. Why is that? Elkisher has prebiotic fiber, which is fertilizer for good bacteria. I just talked about that. Milk thistle, you guys know that's a liver detox. It helps us with producing enzymes, bile, and it's a great antioxidant. We have protease, which is an enzyme that breaks down protein. One of the things we're consuming quite a bit of on the Yoli program. It has lactase, which helps break down the lactose. And then amylase breaks down starch into sugar. It has dried plum, which promotes good bacteria, can reduce the risk of colon cancer. And cranberry, which targets and suppresses bad bacteria and decreases inflammation in the gut. As you can see, it's about the environment. We have to create an environment in our microbiome for it to, to flourish. You can put in all the bacteria you want, millions upon billions and billions and billions. If your environment is poor, they still die. And finally, the Resolve, the last product of the transformation kit. Um, it's got multiple different ingredients. I've listed a, a, a section of them here. It, it's basically glucomannan fiber, which is, and it has multiple different studies on it. Glucomannan fiber is a very slick fiber. It absorbs 10 times its weight in water. So it, it creates viscosity within the gut. Um, it helps with immune function, decreases weight gain, decreases inflammation, and decreases constipation. That's due to that viscosity. Apple cider vinegar, an amazing thing, an amazing natural product. It's just that sometimes it's a little hard to get in just due to people's palates and taste. So it's similar to lemons in that it's an acid on the surface, but has an alkalizing effect in the human body. It's antibacterial, antiviral, and antifungal. It has cayenne in it, which helps boost our immune system, increases our saliva, which means our enzymes. Enzymes are the key to breaking down our food, it stimulates circulation, it reduces acidity, and increases satiety. So it just really helps us as far as uh, feeling of fullness, but also getting rid of that acid and getting rid of the inflammation. Apple fiber helps maintain intestinal balance by cleansing action and prebiotics. Um, it absorbs water, increasing satiety. So Again, another thing that absorbs that water and really provides bulk for the intestinal volume. And then finally, cinnamon. Cinnamon is an antioxidant. It's an anti-inflammatory, antimicrobial. It's an immune booster, and it's number seven on the auric scale, the, uh, the, which is basically the, the, the O2 radical scale. So it's one of the best at providing antioxidant capabilities. So that's our resolve. So to wrap it up here, you guys, what is Yoli and what does it provide? Yoli is an amazing program, as you guys can hear, just in our transformation kit alone, which is just those key five products, there's an array of other products that we offer to help with different challenges. But what does the transformation kit really provide? Number one, it provides instruction. You've got great nutrients, you've got great supplements, but now it's gonna provide you with instruction, a path 
uh, if you will, that shows you how to get to your goals of health and weight loss, whatever they may be. We also provide accountability, right? You don't just buy the program. You can buy a program off of Amazon. You can buy a program, but you don't get us. You don't get the person who's going to be there holding your hand, helping you through this and making sure you succeed, troubleshooting you, helping you get off plateaus. That is the follow-up. And that is probably the key to the success of our program. And we've had amazing success. The average is 16 pounds of weight loss in 30 days. That's the average, which is really, really amazing. And then there's the tools, right? So we have multiple different social media sites. We have different recipe books, whatever it is, we have the tools and the resources to make sure you succeed. And then finally, and maybe most importantly, the caring and fun culture. You guys, when you join Yoli, you don't just join a company with amazing products. You don't just join a company that has a box that's all inclusive, a, a meal plan that shows you what to do and different resources. You don't just join that. You actually join a culture of awesome people. We all help each other. We all troubleshoot. We're all gonna be here to make sure you succeed and to take care of you. And I think when it really comes down to it, you guys, that's what it's all about. That's the key to this whole thing. So with that, I'm gonna wrap it up and I will turn it back over to you. Okay.